hasn't been in great form so far in this competition. What can he do here? Oh, yeah! It's a good one. Oh. It's over 21 metres, and Very he will be into the medals. Very happy with that. He's still not done either. Looks like his coach sitting there. Well, maybe we need a bit more yelling. Might be the secret. Very, very quick in the circle. That right leg just swings right around and he whips himself into action. And this one is going to move him into the medals, you would imagine. Top at the moment, 2189. Well, it's further than that. It's over 21 metres. So he should move into second place here. It won't be enough to challenge Miknovic. 21-26. So Nelson goes from eighth to second. A handy move at the start of round four. Joan Justin's got nothing to lose now. Just he doesn't. Go for every one. Absolutely. He's in the final. That's better. No, no, lost it at the end. Just looked if a little bit low. I was just going to say, he looked like he came over the top of the shot put then, didn't quite get underneath it. Obviously, you need to have a bit of height there to uh, to get it out. He was definitely quicker, I think, in the circle that time, but didn't control it. Perhaps just a bit of a letdown. He's in the top eight. Mm. He's probably just wrapped with that. So probably not a bad thing to uh, just get this one out of the way and two more to go. Calm down and then see if you can hit it. Got to reevaluate your goals really quickly. His goal this morning would have been to make the top 12 and then it's to make the top eight. And now you think, well... Do what you can. Yeah, let's Throw see if we can get a medal. Shot put final continues. Villanov comes into the circle for round five. And another good effort too. Approaching the 21 metre mark. It's a foul. So Bilinov, who moved to third in round three, with 21-1-0. What's in third place at the moment, Jane? 21-10, and that yeah. Justin Antlerzark's capable of doing that. He is indeed. I had a look at that before, and if he really got onto one, then you could see him doing that as he heads into the circle. So round... Sixth round throw, and that one consistent throwing. In fifth currently, does that move him up? In his best throw, 20-61. Well, Scott Murphy absolutely delighted with the effort of Justin Anlazark here. His best throw of 20 metres 61 in round five, Brook Kruger. Australian hammer thrower just in front and he's currently in fifth place in the final of the shot put. Men's shot put final and this was the round five attempt for Justin Anlazak. He's in the top eight and looking to improve. Still ball tucked under the chin. And this is a good effort. It's a great throw. That's better. Approaching the 21 metre mark. The coach, Scott Murphy, is delighted. That'll move him up a place or two. Hope Angela's not too excited. <laughs> Hang in there. We do not want induced birth. <laughs> this has been a great performance. Good day at the office for Justin Anlazark in his first major championship final. He's in currently in eighth, but he's going to improve on that position here. In fact, we've had a pretty good day at the office, full stop, with the team. With uh, Oh, there he goes, up into fifth position, 2061. That's fantastic. 2061 and in fifth place. Final round. Well, Nelson's in second place at the moment, courtesy of the 21 26 in round four. And. He's searching for the gold medal. He needs 21.69. Would it be another silver? 
He's got a world championship and an Olympic silver. That one might be a bit flat. It is. It won't improve his position. But he went from eighth to second in round four. Just snuck in the top eight. And it looks at the moment like he is going to get his hands on another world championship silver medal. Geez, angry, isn't he? <laughs> he would not want to get in his way between the uh, shot put circle and the board. No, I reckon they'll celebrate tonight, the shot putters. A busy day out early for the qualifying round at 8.30. And then the final tonight just got a bit off balance. He knew that that wasn't enough, but he didn't come in the best of form. He's only here courtesy of Gadina being the champion. He was fourth in the US trials, but he's got the silver medal at the moment. Of course, the defending champion gets given a wild card entry to every event. Yuri Bilanov currently in third place. Best so far of 21 metres 10. And approaching... It's probably around 21 metres, no just below that. Yeah, I don't think he's improved. He needs 21, 26. He's not going to get there, is he? So, Billanog is confirmed as the bronze medalist. Nelson's got the silver. Justin Anlazak in fifth place is a tremendous result. To go along with Luke Adams, who finished fifth in the walk, that's a good day for the Australians. And Benita Willis breaking the national record in the 10K. Tams and Lewis, Clinton Hill both making the semi-finals. Stuart, Stuart Rendell. Rendell making the final. Everyone's performed up to scratch today. So the men's shot put is going to be taken out by this man. Andre Miknovic from Belarus. He knows he is the world champion. Magnificent series of throws. Four so far in excess of 21 metres. His best 21.69 coming in round number two. Absolutely deserves to win it. 21.24 was his worst throw. So it's a celebration. Oh, another big throw too. Don't know if it'll be the 21.69, but it's around the 21 and a half metre mark for Andre Miknovic from Belarus. Tenth in the final in 2001. And the 27-year-old will take the first field event final here in Paris. So 21.44, and the gold medal in the men's shot put goes to Andre Miknovic. Look of, satisfa look of satisfaction on the face. So the results, Miknovic the gold, Nelson silver, Bilanog the bronze medal, and Justin Anlazak, 20 metres 61, takes fifth place in the men's shot put final.